Hey, it's the after show. Thank you so much for supporting me. I really do mean it. Uh, hope your Chrissy was cromulent and you're ready for a tolerable new year. Well, look at this. <laughs> um, my mum inherited this from her dad, known as my granddad, and now I'm being given it. It is literally the newspaper from 1969 of going to the moon. This is wild. <laughs> well, this big blurry whatever here, but I mean, that's a big deal. I was a man on a rock. It's amazing. This is fun because this is like for us Adelaide folk, yeah? So it's like 12.30 p.m. today, Neil Armstrong was on the moon thing. But the fun is, we get the whole stinking paper. <laughs> the dream. S Space Wars. Can't wait for them. Um, that looks good. I want to be in that bit. And <laughs> this business. Hang on. Man, they were really going for it. I mean, yeah, and this reality is still the reality. I mean, we just want to be, you know, manning a rake on the moon again. Two spacemen in TV pictures. Chill, dark, and wholesome. Every kind of rock. Nice. Uh, you see all, like, the, the strange cartoons they're making at the, the, the time. Huh? The whole world's watching. What are you waiting for? Is this, like, about the fact that... You know, the whole procedure just took a while to actually, like, you know, get out of the capsule and do stuff. It's like, well, you step out into the middle of, like, the abyss with the planet in the background. Like, shut up, everyone. You go and do it. A lot of people didn't realize that the Soviet Union had a satellite orbiting at the same time. You could see it in the background shooting past in some points. It's like, yeah, very interesting. And three ways at Freeman's. Right, look at that cromulent Kingswood. I'd, I'd actually love that. Oh, popping a Godfrey's on Randall Street, mate, for this Sanyo three-piece stereo, 59 bucks. I mean, you know, get a moon badge or get a new Sanyo three-piece stereo, 59 bucks. Whoa, 23-inch telly, mate, that's huge. HMV TV, not HDTV. <laughs> Talking about it should have been a school holiday for all the kids to watch it and all that sort of stuff. Everyone knew it was an insanely big deal. <laughs> <laughs> Look, a free postcard. Great. Yeah, I'll post away for that one. Oh, and, and for a 10 buck Hoover, I bet that works better than a modern one. All right, settle down, man. You're glad you got your taxes back, but you're looking straight into my eyes here. This guy looks like he's getting news that, like, his friend has crashed his car that he didn't know he was borrowing. That's that face. <laughs> this is where these haircuts have come from. They've never gone away. I want to be like Peter McNally. Let me be like Peter McNally. I mean, this could be you. I'm guessing these comics were meant to be a running series. You catch it every day, but it's just like, in the cellar hideout, the phantom quickly overcomes General Bababoo and his thugs. <laughs> Straight to the armpit MMA move right there. Bah! And then it's just like, where is he going? What happened? It's all too much for me. And that's it. Th that's it. I don't get it. I don't get it. What's little Joey crying for, Miss Dobson? He just been vaccinated by the doctor. I don't believe in vaccination. Why is that? My nephew was vaccinated. He died two days later. What did he die of? He was hit by a train. Why is she smiling about that? 17 bucks, mate. Hey, you can just chuck down 50 cents a week. You can have this bedspread. What do I gotta do to have a mo like Willie Fidel? Ben, her. This is the back in the day where they just drew everything. <laughs> everything was drawn. I am drinking from a bottle. And immediately, marketers are like, quick, get on the rocket trend. Quit, prices are put in orbit. <laughs> I'm riding the rocket on the top because I'm a total spud missile. Ah, full page ads. <laughs> They've never gone away. Oh! What people are selling. Someone's selling a bunch of bats. I think cars, trucks, and tractors. Huge discounts to everyone. Main North Road, Enfield. <laughs> oh, I want some mattresses. Six bucks. That's a, that's, that's a good deal. Motorcycle wanted any sort. Cash. Anything. Any. <laughs> you can get a guitar for nine bucks. Nine buck guitar. Someone's cut something out of this. We'll never know. Oh, well, at least I can see this Mazda 1200. Oh, and more marketing, John Bowden. Yeah, like, while well, they're up there, don't you forget who's got the most... That's John Bowden. People didn't realize how many unknowns going to the moon had, right? And it's like, their spacesuits absolutely got clogged with dust. It was like destroying them and ripping them to pieces. And it's still an issue to this day with any future moon missions. It's like, yeah, this is how like the people who knew were acting. And it's what all the marketers are like, Dad, put a rocket on it. Let's sell some paddle pops. <laughs> this 
this is what they thought the dream was? What does that do? And there you go. We're, we're back at the thing. That's awesome. This is such a cool heirloom. And it's, it's mine forever. Do want the, the, those deals on that Holden though. Maybe one day. So, thanks so much guys. Mate, you know, again, have a tolerant new year. And I'll, I'll see you I'll see you